What's up, Joy Riders? We gotta get this tag out of the car. We gotta get this thing hung up on the wall. Right here, my messy trunk. Yeah, let's get this hung up. The tag I got from David over at American Muscle. He's also the guy that brought the donuts. Thank you again. Awesome, we're gonna get this thing hung up. We got her up. Again, if you guys wanna send in tags, the PO box is in the description, as well as where you can get the merch. We got the new white tees. They're on the website if anybody's interested. And guess what? We hit 70,000 subscribers on the channel. Super exciting, but don't forget, once we hit 75,000, Bex already promised that she would be doing a burnout on her bike with her Shocker Racing shorts. So we gotta get to 75K for that, but the ultimate goal is 100K. That's, that's the ultimate goal. That's what we're really shooting for is 100,000 subscribers, and let's see if we can get there by the end of the year. So that's the goal, see if we can hit 100,000 subscribers on the channel before the end of 2018. So, and also I wanted to talk about the exhaust system because a lot of you guys have commented about the exhaust, about when it was closed, if it was restricted and all that stuff. It's not fully restricted when it's closed. There is a little bypass on there. Wait, let me just show you. See, there's actually a hole right there to the left and the muffler that kind of bypasses that when that flap is completely closed. So, it's not always restricted. But with that being said, I probably wouldn't go wide open throttle with that closed. So a few of you guys have commented about putting the car on the dyno with it closed and open just to kind of see the power difference. I'm not gonna try that. <laughs> so anytime I'm gonna get on it or go wide open throttle, that, that's gonna be open, trust me. So right now we're gonna go meet up with a uh, couple other guys. They've got some Mustangs. So there's a 2018 GT and then a uh, three valve. Three valve guy was talking a little bit of smack. So uh, he said it could outrun my ST. So we're gonna go show him that his three valve cannot run my daily driver ST. They're not ready for that. They, yeah, n none of them are ready for that. But we're gonna go uh, show him what the ST's got. So let's go hit the road. How you doing? Good to see you, good to see you. What's up, man? What's up, how you good doing, JD? Up. This is our meeting place right here, 7-Eleven. So I just uh, ran into these guys here. You want to introduce yourself to the vlog? What's going on, guys? I am That Orange GT, if you guys don't know me. And uh, this is my 2018 Mustang GT, if you guys haven't seen it before. And hopefully JD Jordan likes it. I know he was talking some, you know, some crap about him, so I guess we'll see. He's actually starting a new YouTube channel. Your channel is fairly new. You've got 1,600 yeah. subscribers. He's going to try to out-clickbait Mike, Street Speed 717 because that's that's your yeah, goal, I mean, right? Yeah, I mean, clickbait is key. I mean... You have people, been clickbaiting them, right? I mean, if you guys know me, you guys know I clickbait. And I guarantee you, at least some people watching your videos know my videos because they clickbait or because of my clickbait. You clickbaited them. Right, right, clickbaited them. But, you know, if you're from Street Speed 717, you should just expect clickbait these days. It, it's what we do. Oh, come on. <laughs> he is a cool dude. I mean, not talking yeah. crap. Not talking crap. That's you know, just where YouTube guy. has gotten, though. Right. What do you have here? Because he was calling me out. <laughs> I just have this uh, revalve here, uh, 2009 GT. Uh, 2009? Yeah. You th so how do you think that this will do up against the ST? Oh, oh man, I mean, I just gotta wait and see, you know, you never know what, what's gonna happen. Okay, okay. You, Might be interesting race. you were talking shit before I turned the camera on. What happened <laughs> he now? Was, he he was. what? Wasn't he, he was, talking he shit? He was talking so much shit. And see, the funny thing is, you know, he was like, oh, I'm gonna take And he was talking, yeah, and wasn't he talking crap about the V6 that pulled off out of here yeah, too? V6 got nothing on his three valve, and I'm like, yeah. calm down, man. It's just 300 horsepower. <laughs> well, yeah. Just telling the truth, you know? <laughs> just telling the truth. <laughs> when I had my STI, I used to, like, blow these things away all the time. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. yeah I man. pulled RV links on these things. <laughs> it's like that dude in blue, but that orange GT. I mean, yeah, maybe. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's very similar. That's Roast like, the Mustang, guys. Don't tell that dude in blue my car is better. But, you know? <laughs> oh, is it better? No, I mean, if he wants to race me, I'm here. I mean, just wait till next month when you I get You know David's subscriber. a subscriber. He's probably going to see this. <laughs> oh, you think so? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, just wait till right, hope he sees you hope he sees it? <laughs> All right, David, he's talking smack on you. I'm just going to call everyone out. I mean, anyone who wants to race me, I'm here. You know where I'm at. You know my channel. So you need to change your YouTube channel, That Shit Talker GT. Well, I'll, I'll say yeah. more like that clickbait GT because it works a lot better. But. I need to find out how this dude got all these mods and how much did you spend for all these mods? You don't, you don't want to know. Don't want to know? Yeah. It's too much. You want to explain to us what you got done to this? Yeah, guys. So basically, <laughs> it's all pretty much cosmetic wise. I have it lowered on Gecko Racing Coilovers. Okay. And that adds 200 horsepower. <laughs> 
And also, um, I got these R2R 20-inch rims. Okay. I'm running uh, 275 in the back and 255 in the front. And All right. So he's got drag radials. <laughs> Got these fake scoops to just roll up. No, those things are real, dude. That's pretty real, man. And they're actually aerodynamic. The air actually goes through. The air comes through here, and then it directs through here, and then it curves and helps push the car. That's that's what those do. Yeah, you cannot deny physics. <laughs> right. Oh, dude, you've got the uh, 13, 14 right. like, yeah. taillights. So that automatically means your car is what 400 horsepower because what are those 420 stock? I do have to say I love the color. I bet you pick up a lot of dudes in this don't you? Oh yeah, every day. <laughs> every day. <laughs> you got headers, exhaust, intake, tune, what yeah, I mean. I got a custom exhaust, so BBK off-road X-Pipe, so I'm not running cats. <laughs> and, um, and I have a Borla Attack axle back system. So. Okay, so just basic bolt-ons. Yeah. So. Um, if I had, if I did headers, it'd probably be too loud. So I'll all right, neighbors. here, pop the hood. Let's check it out. Still faster than DBP, though, right? Oh, for sure. Uh, I hope DBP's listening to, to this too. Oh yeah. Listen, if he wants to race me, he knows where I'm at. I'm, tell, I'm calling oh. everyone out in this vlog. Oh, you're gonna call out DBP also? For sure, for sure. When he gets his uh, blower on, wherever he's putting on, I think he's getting like a supercharger, right? Oh, uh, turbo, supercharged turbo. I think I think he's just bullshitting everybody. I don't think he got anything. Maybe, <laughs> maybe. I mean, you never know until you know, right? But I think one of his buddies got a supercharger, and he just made a clickbait video. Probably borrowing it from a friend. <laughs> Dude, you still got the stock intake on here. Yeah. You don't see out. that anymore. Yeah. Change that out next. Yeah. Dude, we can change that out now. Just undo it, and where's that sock? Put that sock <laughs> on there. There you go. It's gonna work. Trust me. I've seen this done before. Let's show them the ST. The ST is just pretty much bone stock. The only thing done to the ST is just the wheels. Wheels don't do anything and window tint. Window tint adds aerodynamics. Did you need to see under the hood of the ST? So you know I'm not... I think so. Just to make sure. Just to make sure. I mean, you don't have to in a monster like this. I mean, right. it speaks for itself in acceleration. But yeah, wow. look at that. I mean, all completely stock. That's a rare for an ST too, to be honest. To it see is. a stock ST. Probably and this one. Mustang killer is for set. I'm gonna go inside 7-Eleven and I'm gonna ask the guy if he'll drive my car because I need a driver mod because you guys know that I don't know how to drive. That's why I never race my cars on YouTube. So let me go ask this guy if he'll race my ST for me. Can you uh, race my car real quick for me? Yeah, just, I'm trying to get my, uh, I'm trying to beat this guy and I need a professional uh, driver mod. You can do that? When? Like, tonight? like yeah, tonight. I got for eight. Alright, thanks. I don't even need a helmet. No, you don't need a helmet. You don't need a helmet, you're good. Alright, so I got my professional driver. So he's gonna race my car for me. And uh so we'll just we'll actually you know what we'll get right to that. Good to roll, I repeat, good to roll. Alright. Let's race. I think the ST definitely won that one. I don't know what happened there. We're going to have to do another one because that, that was unacceptable. So we're back over here at 7-Eleven and my driver, he had to get back to work. My driver, he's pretty good. He's a damn good driver. Oh yeah. I was actually impressed. The cars are pretty damn close. I would say they're pretty equal because you got two, my driver, uh, I think he got two on you. I know that first one, um, 
I missed the gears. Granny shifting, <laughs> not double clutching. Not double clutching like a shit. So basically just X-pipe and exhaust, complete bone stock ST. Those are the results. They're pretty equal. I mean, they're pretty equal, but I must say the Mustang does look better. All right, we're back home in the garage. So if anybody is looking for a Mustang killer, the ST is for sale and it's faster than a three valve Mustang. So there you go. Sorry, sorry all my three valve viewers. I'm just trying to sell my car. Once the car is sold, then the three valve Mustangs are faster. But anyways, while I'm trying to sell the car, the ST is faster. But a lot of people is always giving me crap about not racing this. Well, let me just say, there is going to be a, I don't want to say it without giving it away. I'm going to be doing a few things to this car. And then once that happens, I will take the car to the track. I will run it and I'll get in some race videos for you guys that want to see those. So we'll start getting those out for you. But in the meantime, until I get that done and worked out, but there's going to be a whole other video talking about why and everything, but we're not going to get into that. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like button, subscribe if you're not already subscribed to the channel for some awesome content. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.